Hey everyone, it's Howard. I'm a comic book artist for Marvel, DC, Dark Horse, and Image. My newest book is The Wondrous World, which I did with Armando Zanker and Simone Arena. Today I'm going to review brush pens that I got from Daiso. Daiso is this Japanese chain store that's out here in California and I'm pretty sure they're in other parts of America. It's like a 99 cent store but the products are better and they used to be $1.50 each but now thanks to inflation they're $1.75. And they sell these uh, brush pens. Um, mostly, most of them are manufactured by themselves. The thing with Daiso though is they make different type of brush pens from time to time and I'm not sure why. Like uh, this is previous pen that I got from them that I liked. Um, it was a uh, made you fill it that you could change with a cartridge. And I like this brush pen that they used to make or used to sell, but they stopped selling it, so I'm not sure why. So if you're watching this uh, review two or three years from now, they might have different type of pens that they're selling. So today I'm gonna review the ones that they, they currently are selling and like a big size type of nib brush extra fine nib This is their more, more flexible type of brush. Okay, here's how the brushes are. This is the extra fine, the extra fine. Pretty good. This is the bigger brush. Alright, this isn't as good. It's kind of streaky. Maybe it's just the breaking in. Or the bigger brush is streaky. Alright. I'm going to try the flexible. The flexible nib. Okay, 
It is really flexible. It's almost like a real brush. It is Okay, so far I would say the first the first one and the third one were good. The second one, pretty bad, could have just got a bad one. A bad, bad pin in the batch, but we shall see. I'm gonna test out the brushes inking this Harley Quinn piece I penciled, and let's see how it comes out. Here's the finished drawing. Okay, I do recommend these two Daiso brushes, but I do not recommend this, this non-Daiso brush. I made like one line with it and it didn't look good, so I didn't use it again. If you have used these Daiso brushes before, let me know what you think of them in the comments below. Also, if there are other art products you want me to review, let me know that as well. Thanks for watching and remember to click on like and subscribe.